Today we're checking out Audrey Sad Origin Story Cartoon Animation by Game Tunes. Let's dive right on in. My name is Audrey. Most of my life I thought I was made to draw my pal Bendy. To use ink. But now I realize I was It's really cool that they're now living. making animations of the Dark a monster, Revival. A freak. It all started one stormy night at the office. I was working late to meet our studio's deadline, and I decided I needed to get some coffee downstairs in order to stay awake. That's the moment my life changed forever. Huh? Audrey. It was Wilson, custodian of the ink, or at least... That's what he liked to call it. I mm. think his actual job title was janitor. He was always polite to me, though the way he stared at me sent shivers down my spine. Turns out, I should have trusted my instincts. What was that? Something Please tell me we're not trapped in here. Don't worry, my dear. It's just a little short in the system. Wilson quickly got the lights turned on and said that we needed to flip a few switches to get everything All operational right, let's again. Flip those switches. For whatever reason, he needed me to find a batch of exhibit pieces that went missing from their mantles, including a wrench, a vinyl record, a bottle of ink, a large gear, a bendy plushie, and a book titled The Illusion of Living. But as soon as I did, black ink begins to envelop the room. The old ink machine from Joey Drew's studio has turned back on for the first time in decades. Wilson! Wilson, help! Oh, my dear Audrey, there is much still you need to understand. Find me once you're inside, and I will show you your purpose. Hmm. When I finally woke up, I looked different. My hands and body were covered in ink, and I was inside of some new place devoid of the colors of reality. It was a strange place. Dark, moody, wet. From all the bottles Dang. of black, oily ink, the warm tungsten lights gave it a certain kind of charm. Wilson at the same knows time, your purpose. Everything felt Relax. artificial. Eventually, I came into a large opening. A huge room with black ink cascading like a waterfall Heavenly into a gigantic toys. reservoir. Surely this place could have a radio of some kind. A way for me to signal for help. I decided to explore. That's where I had my encounter with a member of the Butcher Gang. He knocked me off of a wall and dove after me. I ran away and I tried to hide in one of the little miracle stations. Seems safe for a moment. But then. But he found me and he started clawing the box, biting and screeching. I. I could hear the crunching of the wood. He was about to break in when. Alice saved Alice. me. Alice. She was my guardian angel. She told me how to survive down here, to stay hidden in the shadows, to use stealth and avoid the other evil creatures like searchers, the butcher gang, and especially the ink demon. But then she abandoned me. She said she had a wolf to take care of, and that oh, we need to get in the upper levels she where it's to do safer. Something, I guess. So I set out on my quest. Without a way to defend myself, I had to be sneaky to avoid the monsters of this world. Eventually, I found a gent pipe that I could charge up to power specific supply boxes, or let me break open weak locks. Dang. It was most useful Ooh. as a weapon. With this, I didn't always have to run away from every fight. I quickly learned that the only way to heal my wounds down here was to consume more ink. Usually some sort of food, uh. like bacon soup. Along the way, the ink part of me started to get stronger. My hand emanated with a mysterious magical aura, mm. and I gained a new ability. I could banish weaker foes, like searchers, with a single touch, making their gooey bodies disappear into thin air. Wow, just I thought I was stronger. starting to get the hang of this place. But then... I ran into him. Bendy? Bendy! You're real? It's okay. I won't hurt you. I promise. See? I'm your friend. Wait! No! Huh? That was an accident! I'm sorry! Little did I know that would actually be one of the best encounters with Bendy. You see, Bendy has at least two distinct forms. 
the cute and cuddly toy and, and the, the ink demon. The ink de open oh. up, open up! That was the first of several confrontations. I continued to get stronger and stronger along my journey. Of facing him oh, head wow. on would be certain death. So when I saw him approaching, I hid. He never lingered for long. Oh, oh damn, like the voice. voice. A soul. The ink speaks to me. It whispers your secrets. Oh. After that was a series of puzzles and confusing passages. Every step of the way presented a problem for me to overcome or an enemy to defeat. Dang. Are you stuck? <laughs> well, yes. And I'm afraid that means, well, you're stuck too. Perhaps you huh? could get me unstuck? But not everyone down here was evil. I met some interesting characters, like Porter. <laughs> As a token of his gratitude, Porter granted me the power of flow, which let me teleport small distances. It helped me leap over nice. several pits that otherwise would have been impossible to cross. I was finally starting to get the hang of this place, but I didn't want to belong in this realm. I wanted to escape, to get home. The ink inside me was slowly taking over my mind. I was beginning to forget what being a human with flesh and bones felt like. Dang, what? Then I crashed. Crashed. When I woke up, disgusting ink spider surrounded me. Oh, look at I those clutched spiders. my gen pipe and prepared for battle. That's when their queen showed up. It crawled out of the depths to attack me alongside its minions. Whoa. The fight seemed endless. Hordes of widows lunging at me left and right. New ones constantly hatching from their eggs. I mustered up all my strength and focused on the queen. My charged gen right. pipes and electric shock threw its body and it was fried alive. The others quickly fled after that. Nice. I was alive for now, but I was beaten down. I couldn't go on like this forever. I needed answers. And it seemed like at every turn, I was presented with more questions. I believe there's something special in all of us, especially you, Audrey. This man was the memory of Joey Drew, a ghost-like fragment from the past. He told Dang. me that everything I was experiencing was part of a time loop. An ink stained nightmare forever stuck so on Joey repeat. Is in this game. It was designed to torment Henry Stein, Joey Drew's old business partner, who he blamed for the failure of his studio. Others got added to the loop later, like Alison Pendle, the love of his life. She saw something good in Joey when no one else could, even himself. That's when he decided to make something he never had before a family. After many tries, I would love a he family. created a daughter. Me. I didn't want to believe him. I wasn't like the rest of these creatures. So I was a human. The daughter I was Joey kind. Drew. I was good. But in my heart of hearts, I knew what he was saying was true. He said a nefarious group of people called the Keepers had come from the outside world and seized control of the time loop. They were hell-bent on preventing the cycle from rebooting. He urged me to stop them. Never forget, you're here for a reason, Audrey. There's always a reason, even when you can't understand it. Didn't you make this world? Why can't you fix it? Because I'm not the man. I'm just the memory. From there, I yeah. knew what I had to do. I found the lair of the keepers and was prepared for whatever dangers lied up ahead. Once inside, I stumbled onto all sorts of characters. A girlish lost one named Heidi who wanted to play hide and seek. An enormous slack jawed lurker. Even Henry Stein himself, who explained how I could break the cycle for good. I tried to be careful, but I was eventually captured by a keeper and brought to Wilson. To my Wilson. surprise, he didn't hurt me. In fact, he convinced me that he wasn't evil at all, that he had a plan to defeat the ink demon forever. I fell right into his trap. Again, wow. his plan wasn't to kill Bendy, but to make a new, even more powerful entity that could control him by using my soul. Dudley. I 
killed the beast with every Oh yeah, that's the final boss. But at the end, I needed the ink demon to save me. I yeah. couldn't fight it anymore. I let the blackness take over me. I became one with the ink demon. Though with the help of my new friends, I was able to regain enough control to reach Dang. my final destination. A yeah. film that would reset the cycle and end my nightmare for good. With that, I was free and back where I belonged. I know now that my past was shrouded in mysteries, in darkness. Oh, a past? And now I can make the loop a better place. And with Bendy by my side, my future looked brighter than Aww. ever. Very interesting story on the entire game. Very interesting indeed.